okay, this is a really bizarre day. <laughs> and now I was saying, you know, the JFK energy was so, <laughs> you know. And so who pops in? But uh, let me move these here real quick and uh, so I can get to the underneath of this. Um, but uh, I kid you not, now, only the older people here are going to probably remember who this is. Soupy Sales. Out of the blue. Soupy Sales. Is... <laughs> okay. And what I got is he was a vibrant personality. That's what I got at the very top of it. Um... He was let to bring a lot of innocence to his show, judgment, the lovers, um, you know, he was good at what he did. The judgment was the strength. Um, he was resilient, dedicated to his craft, okay, and he's strong, and, and it says in death, he's moved forward, okay, he's moving forward, and uh, yeah. So, what else did I get from Soupy Sales? <laughs> Soupy Sales. Um, <laughs> or his name was Milton uh, Supman to begin with. Um, crazy guy. He's the one that would always, he would have, what was it, Fang and... Uh, black tooth or something like that. And he would always take a pie to the face and uh, had a kid's show. Um, yeah, but what I got from the other side, above everything, it's about empowerment, okay? And, and he came, I think today, because kindred spirits is about empowering others and uh, under that, underneath of that, what was um, going on, the energy around it is love and romance, empowerment, kindred spirits, you know, that type of a thing of light worker, kind of light workers. And um, it says, uh, going into this, he's receptive and to imagination. Now, this is not surprising. Okay, because <clears throat> he had a kid's show, and uh, yeah, it was, he would bring all these crazy things out. I guess it said, I just went and read on him a little bit. When he was in the Navy, he would get on there and uh, do crazy things while he was in the Navy to entertain the guys and things. Um, so what I got from Conscious Thing is about the secrets secrets of the universe and um, what you find uh, and who he is, how he sees himself as surprise. <laughs> <You know? laughs> secrets, surprise, you know. Um, he said he always tried to do the best show he could do, okay? And it was always about, you know, making people happy and this and that type of thing. So he's kind of a light worker in his own way. Um, he, in the past, was about illuminate, illuminating. It was about going for ma the magic. It's about uh, creating change and celebration. Okay, so it's just uh, you know he, he's on the other side and he's just saying basically give the best you can do be open to the magic you know and surprise and uh you know you'd be surprised the secrets you find you know and and have the kindred spirits spread the love be out there and be a light um so yeah that's what i'm getting he's just uh, seems to be the same kind of person he was you know, when he was on earth, that he, um, yeah, just wants to spread love and light and, you know, all of that type of thing. So basically, <laughs> I don't know how, how did he come 
in, you know. This is not somebody I would be thinking about, you know, <laughs> Subi Sales. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm sitting there and all of a sudden he pops in and I'm going, you know. <laughs> Where is this coming from? So it was about, you know, lightening the mood. And, uh, you know, he's over there to, to lighten the mood for people. And uh, <laughs> I get the feeling he's, he'd be there. He'd be happy to take a pie in the face if that would <laughs> lighten the mood. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Soupy sales. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, he was very dedicated to his craft um, uh, of the show that he was doing and stuff. And, um, and is just, you know, wants to spread that light and that love. And, you know, saying, you know, kindred spirits keep out there with that light. Keep sharing the light, sharing the love, sharing the magic you know, bringing surprise, you know, uh, and share the secrets of the universe, which is, you know, again, light and love and continue to go forward. In that. <laughs> so thanks for that, Soupy. <laughs> yeah, I read a little bit on his thing today and it was saying um, his family was the only Jewish family in town and um, he said that he, he got his name Soupy because as a kid, I, I think one of the, his brothers was called Hambone, and then they had another one, and then he was Soup Bone. <laughs> so, <laughs> it sounds like a crazy family, <laughs> okay? Kind of a crazy family. And uh, yeah, he was just kind of a, a funny guy just had that kind of personality um yeah so that was interesting that he just popped in soupy sales and uh <laughs> wanted to share that yeah he said he, when his kids were in school <laughs> um you know everybody called him soupy sales and they called the kid's name, uh, whatever it was, Irving something, and, and then the, they, you know, didn't respond, you know. And they said, your kids only know the name Sales. You need to change your name. So he did. <laughs> he wound up <laughs> making Sales his last name. And so now his children are all known by, you know, the last name of Sales as well. <laughs> So that was interesting. <laughs> Thank you for that, Soupy. <laughs> oh my goodness, what a crazy guy. That's <laughs> You just never know. You never know. I mean, out of all the personalities there are out there, I, I don't think Soupy Sales is one that I would have been <laughs> early. <laughs> gravitating to to check out and see what they're doing on the other side but it, you know sometimes you have these things and they just pop in you know <clears throat> out of the blue just boop and there he was and and I go well okay <laughs> oh mercy we can do this I can I can look at soupy and you know But yeah, in the beginning, the, the one laid out I did, it's all about his judgment. It was about fairness, light, you know, and uh, even it, it is said in the death, he wanted to move things forward and is on, you know, uh, continuing in that vein on the other side. So, <laughs> oh, mercy, mercy. What else today? What? <laughs> Oh, so anyway, yeah, thank you for that, Soupy. <laughs> Thanks for popping in and sharing uh, some old memories. 
I remember as a kid watching and he'd get hit in the face with the pie and stuff. And, uh, you know, back then, you know, you think this is really great and everything. And you watch it now and it's kind of, you know, like, <laughs> my goodness. But back then, man, that was uh, that was some good stuff. <laughs> so I'm going to leave this here, and we'll see you online. Love and light. <laughs> Enjoy your journey, Soupy. <laughs>